Now, I never remember listening to your father, and certainly didn't listen to your grandfather, but um, people my mother's age who did <laughs> say that uh, you're a chip off the old block. Is that well, right? That, that, that is uh, as uh, nice a thing as you could say to me, really. Well, you asked me to say it. I did. Hey, you should take the show on the road, or on the airwaves anyway. A popular voice is returning to his roots. John Gambling is back on the radio, where his family's New York radio dynasty began more than 75 years ago. Please welcome longtime radio talk show host, John Gambling. So nice oh, my goodness here. gracious. A round of applause. Isn't that, isn't that nice? Morning, Jody. Well, it's such a pleasure to have you. And folks, from, well, some folks still around remember your grandfather signing on shortly after the station itself went on the air in 1922. 19, yeah, exactly so. I mean, we've been hanging, gambling's been hanging around New York radio for a very, very long time. And uh, it's, it's, it's wonderful to be going back to WOR. It's, it's, uh, it's like Dorothy clicking her heels and uh, with the ruby red slippers and ending up back in Kansas. There's no place like home. There is no place like like home. And Absolutely. the mayor's going to be joining you. The mayor is. Uh, I am. Th I am thrilled about this. Uh, the mayor has uh, become a good friend of mine, and I think we get along really well from a, from a news uh, point of view. And I think that uh, it's it's absolutely wonderful that he has taken the time and the effort to come back with me Friday mornings between 8 and 9, uh, each and every Friday. Well, we know you've met a lot of interesting people in your career thus far. Faces maybe from years ago. Can Mr. You Gambling, your them? coffee. Sir. Oh my goodness gracious! You might not. Well, actually, I'll hold this for you. But I used to work, and I don't know that you would remember this at all. But Joe Bartlett, your news director Absolutely. at WOR, hired me right out of school in the early '90s, and my first job in this business was in the newsroom at WOR. And what year would that have been? 1991. 1991. So well, please say hello to my old boss, I will. Joe. You'll be working with Joe again. We will. Uh, Joe's going to be doing the news. He's going to be sort of my wingman uh, starting Monday morning at 5:30. Do you need someone to bring you coffee? Uh, I do. I, can you, do you still do that? Can you can you come down? I would do whatever before you, you come here. Whatever you <laughs> needed me to do. I Just hop do. on the six train. Exactly. We'll be there in no time. Yeah, you know absolutely. what's it like? Because Jody was talking about how you know the audience really feels as though. They know you. They know your family because you're so familiar. Um, how how is it that you sort of make that connection with everybody? Well, you know, it's interesting about radio because it, it's the most intimate of mediums. I think uh, even a little bit more so than television because you don't have the distance between the camera and and us sitting here this morning. When I'm on the radio, I come out of the radio in your shower, in your car, in in, in your most personal places. And I've been around for so long. I, yesterday I was on the air with some people that were reminiscing that they they listened to me when I was four years old doing things at Christmas time that's 50 that's over 50 years and um, the connection is one that's very special and means a lot to me and and I take it with great responsibility because uh, it, it is uh, an important part of a lot of people's lives and they make a conscious decision to turn me on every single morning or whenever I happen to be on so they invest in me just like your uh, viewers do in, in you and it's absolutely critical and I'm just a regular guy, and I think that that's part of the part of the equation. Well, it's such a pleasure to see you here, and I know folks are very excited. You're back on the airwaves. What are you taking your coffee? Uh, a little cream and uh, maybe a Splenda or something like that. All right, I'll be right back. <laughs> that was part of my job. I would bring coffee into the news. Oh, that's anybody great. Asked. Hey, listen, it shows that Joe picked some good talent. <laughs> Please say hi to Joe, and I it's will. great to have you. All Thank the you. best Thank on you, your Jody. return to WOR, and you can listen to John Gambling. Rambling with Gambling, once again beginning this coming Monday morning.